Western bluebirds used to be commonly seen in Gary Oak Meadows across Vancouver Island and the Gulf Islands. Used to be until the 1950s. But now, 60 years later, these sweet little birds are being sighted once again. Here's V. Cooper. Are they there? Wow. Just like the saying goes, if you build it, they will come. These are western bluebirds, and they haven't been seen on Vancouver Island since 1995. Due to habitat loss, loss of Gary Oak ecosystem habitat, uh, invasive species such as starlings, house cats, house sparrows which use their nest natural nesting cavities, uh, they've lost their habitats. But hopefully that's about to change, because the Gary Oak Ecosystems Recovery Team, or GERT as it's known, has arrived. And it's a big team. Researchers and institutions and individuals and government organizations who together work for restoration, recovery and protection of Gary Oak ecosystems. It was just this spring that GERT's Bring Back the Bluebirds project transported 17 western bluebirds across the border. That's right, these birds are Americans. We brought them from Fort Lewis, Washington. There were seven permits involved and so that was a big job even though the birds could fly themselves. We know that they have had four babies from these released birds, so that makes, brings it up to at least 21 birds. We never imagined that we would be seeing bluebirds breeding in the first year of our five-year project, and so we're absolutely ecstatic about that. There's just over a hundred nesting boxes across the Cowichan Valley, regularly monitored by GERT. They make their nests out of grasses, as you can see. We're always looking for volunteers of people who have suitable habitat for bluebirds who are interested in hosting nest boxes. And we sometimes need people who are interested in monitoring boxes in parks and in other areas like that that don't have a, a specific owner associated with them. And if you'd like to volunteer, you can't be squeamish. So these are the mealworms that we supplement the bluebirds diet with while they're establishing. Now that we have this pair that's established on this property and they've been feeding their young and they see that this is a good place. We think the chances are really great. It's a tough life for a bluebird and any bird that is a young one. So in their first year of life, you know, over that first winter, it's a tough go. To help these beautiful little birds repopulate Vancouver Island and the Gulf Islands, log on to GERT, G-O-E-R-T dot C-A. Vital People is brought to you by the Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.